All right, we're super close to the end of year one. Um, it is 25th of winter, so we're basically like a couple days away from year two. Um, I need to try and get my hands on a Nautilus shell. Hopefully I can do that. I kind of need to though, like I don't want to wait until next uh, year, to, next winter to do that. Um, gifting as I can, sell star fruit. I do need to start selling star fruit, I need to start buying some copper. And we're gonna give Shane a hot pepper for the future of the winter star. So basically, oh, I need to plant more coffee plants. There's uh, so many things, so many, so many minor oversights that have become major oversights. Okay, well then. So I need a hot pepper. I don't think I can do any, any other gifting or anything at the Feast of the Winter Star, can I? I don't really think that's a thing. Good luck, that's good. And that's all we care about, all right. Here we go, animals. I have until like 9 a.m. Oh, I can make a bean hot pot. Uh, right, I need to buy a bouquet for Maru ultimately. There's a sewing machine from Emily. Let me go see if I can make a bean hot pot right now. Let's just get this off my list. Where, if I were a bean hot pot, where would I be? Where would I, bean? <laughs> get it, cause bean, bean hot pot. Uh, okay, well clearly not on that page. Um, oh, there it is. I need two green beans. What do you mean I don't have two green beans? What are you what are you saying? I got two green beans right there. Right, right, right there. Alright, sweet, let's make a bean hot pot. I wonder if somebody loves a bean hot pot. Bean hot pot. Beautiful. Uh, alright, let me flip over to my this thing here, and in the cooking section we mark off bean hot pot. Nice. So good. Um, I feel like there may be some stuff on here that I've made that I haven't marked off. But that, I don't know. I don't know if that's true or not. But I won't worry about it right now. At some point, what I'm going to have to do is go through my list and see, um, see kind of what, <laughs> what things I've missed, basically. Uh, okay, so let's, um... Let's not have the triple shot right now. Let me just grab a hot pepper for Shane. You know what, if I can, um, if I can do other gifting, oh, dino mayonnaise, sweet. If I can do other gifting at the Feast of the Winter Star, I might, uh, I might reset the day. Uh, so dinosaur mayonnaise. I think, if I'm not mistaken, I know I need to ship that. That's why I made it. I'm trying to think. If there's any other dino dinosaur egg for dinosaur mayonnaise, and that's it. I'm just gonna check and see if I need dinosaur eggs for anything else. No, just to make a dinosaur mayonnaise. And do I need dinosaur mayonnaise for anything? The missing bundle. The missing. I do have access to the missing bundle now. I haven't done that. So I could keep. I could keep it. I could keep it for one more. I keep it one more. I keep. I'll keep. I'll keep the dinosaur to get one more dino egg, and uh, maybe we'll do the missing bundle as well. Like I say, I'm gonna have more time in year two to do things. So. Um, it's not super crucial that I, uh, super crucial that I, although, how much did Dino Mayonnaise sell for? Sells for, oof, 11.20? <laughs> That's, uh, oof, mercy. That, um, is a good price. It's gonna be kind of hard to want to, uh, not just sell it for money. But once I get Ginger Island going, and now that I can, now that I got my snake spines. Alright. Um, 
Anything else I want to do in here? I don't think so. Let me just check the fruit cave, see if there's anything interesting. I think there were a couple of plums and stuff. This day is kind of a write-off, so I'm not really too fussed. I guess I could go maybe cut down some more trees or something. I could do that. I could go into Cinder Sap and get some more wood. Don't have any quests or anything. Oh, the fish one. Yeah, that's not going to happen. Uh, okay, let me ship this dinosaur mayonnaise. Okay, really need to move that stuff. Shipped. Beautiful. All right, go on to here. Dinosaur mayonnaise. Nice. Okay. Nautilus shell. I'm kind of tempted to take a... a um, sell those, why not? I'm kind of tempted to take a totem to the beach. Maybe I'll do that right before I go to the to the thing. Right before I go to the Winter Star Festival. I feel like that would be a good idea. Where do I have things like this? I guess I've got some scarecrows there. Let me throw the sewing machine, the loom, and the sign. Okay. All in my gifting chest. So. Uh, Toad. What's up, Andrew Hetzel? So what else can I do right now? Um, drop the void egg in there as well. I have an hour. Maybe I will just go cut down some trees, I guess. I do need that wood. Let's just cut down a few trees, then we'll... Well, actually, I have until 2 p.m. I may as well use my energy because... Oh, forgot my animation cancelling. There we go. Uh, I have until 2 p.m. So I'm going to this year until go to like noon or 1 p.m. Just keep cutting stuff down. And then after that, we'll see. So must keep a very close eye on the time, though. Do not want, well, I mean, it'll be a reset. It'll be a reset if I screw it up. Apparently I've cut down most of these trees already. Uh, before I get too crazy wandering around, let me just see if there are any trees left to cut. Because I kind of cut most of the trees in this whole area, I think, already. Uh, yeah, so there's like one tree here. Oh, there's some trees on, on the Arrowhead Island thing, and there's a couple trees there. So yeah, I could, I could go. I got time. Why not? Maybe I'll get an artifact. Oh, I got an artifact. Don't need it, but I got it. Hmm. May as well grab these guys while I'm here. Let's check the hat, the hat, the hat there thing. Do I want any of these uh, hats? Probably not for a thousand. Yeah, no. Good talk. Thanks for showing me the wares. I wonder whose house that used to be. Like, obviously it's like this old abandoned house, but like, I wonder what the story is with that house. Try not to lose too much wood into the water. So good having the perk that gives me extra wood when I cut down trees. Very much needed. Thing down here. Oh yeah, there's one. Still doing okay for time, so. Hey, what's up, Inquinch? How you doing? Love the stream. Thank you very much. Welcome to you. Put eye drops in before I start streaming again, so. I feel like I'm squinting, even though my eyes are probably like wide, wide, wide open right now. So anyways, what did you guys eat? What did you guys all eat today? The exciting part of today was um, Diane wanted to have fajitas for supper. And when we do such things, I make the tortilla shells from scratch. So that was tasty. I quite enjoyed that. 
could just be because it's a huge amount of carbs. Could definitely just be that. Okay, let me go to the, the beach. Cutscene. Didn't expect this. It's a good thing you turned up, lad. Oh, I've got a, a bit of a problem I could use a hand with. <laughs> He's got crabs. Uh, it'd be best if I just showed you. Alright, show me. Take a deep breath now. Oh, made failure shells. <clears throat> oh, I think what this means is... I can buy crab cakes from Gus for a limited time only. As you can see, and smell, the old girls ran wild last night. My experiment needs a little work. Oh, Gus. Gus to the rescue. Ooh, back at it again, huh, Willie? They look fresh, all right. Aye, these are the finest, meatiest crabs you'll ever set your eyes on. They'd be a little too feisty, though. I'll take the whole lot, with a discount for the extra labor, of course. I guess we're helping them collect crabs. All right. Looks like we got them all. Goodbye, me sweet ladies. There'll be crab cakes in no time. Psst, Paul, don't tell Willie, but I'll be doing a special on crab cakes at the saloon for the next few days. I must want, I must take advantage of that. Crab cakes are pretty sweet. If I could get a bunch of them, that would be great. All right, sweet. There's Nautilus shell. I needed that. That is exactly what I needed. But I do have until 2 p.m. Uh, wait. No, okay, good. Don't need that one. Um, so let's take it till 2 p.m. I'm actually surprised I didn't ship an Nautilus shell already, to be honest with you, but... You know, what do you do? Pretty sure I have all the coral I need. As long as I make it back before 2 p.m., we'll be fine. I can't help but think of the French word for failure when I hear fajita. Oh, is that what? Trying to not use my triple shot yet. Oh yeah, we're, we're, we're good. We got time. We got time. All right, let me grab my, whatchamacallit, this thing. Although I will talk to everybody first, actually. All right, let's, uh, we'll talk to them, talk to Marnie first, I guess. Talk to the mayor last. Triple shot. Talk to Pam, talk to Penny. There's Willy, forget Marlin. Oh. The Legend of the Winter Star. Do we want to hear the Legend of the Winter Star? Yeah, let's say yes. In the night sky of winter, there is a bright star only visible from this valley. No one knows why this is, but in times of old, people would come from far and wide to see it. They believed that anyone who laid eyes on the Winter Star would be blessed with, a good, with, with good fortune. Some even claim that the mysterious fruit known as the Star Drop is connected to the Winter Star in some way. Crazy. Uh, Alright, there's Robin. Sebastian. Demetrius. I'll talk with Waifu as well. Again, I can't give her anything, so... Talk to Linus... Can I check garbage cans by any chance right now? No. Worth the shot. Uh, Alright, so... Let's talk with these guys. Can we open presents now? No. Okay, not gonna let me through that way. That's fine. So we did talk to Vincent. Let's talk to Sam. Jody. Alex, Evelyn, George, not that they matter, I've already maxed out the friendship with them. Haley, Emily, what are you hoping to find under the spirit tree? I'm trying to pick something I think Emily would like. Black emergencies, here we go. Leah, Gus, Elliot. It's chilly, isn't it? It's the middle of winter, what do you expect? Clint being a Debbie Downer. No, not yet. There's Caroline. There is Abigail. Let's see what Pierre has. I think I looked at this. I don't think I need to buy anything from here. No recipes, no nothing I need. Um, okay, let me go talk to, oh, I guess that's everybody. There's nobody else like hiding out somewhere else. I can't get into the sewer. Make 
make sure I'm not missing anybody I should be talking to. I think that's pretty much it. Can I get up here? No. What's up, Rainbow Panda? How you doing? Uh, Rainbow Panda, I did, uh, thanks to Lou Gehry's recommendation, I did pick up um, Genshin Impact. You're doing swell? Excellent. It's like, well, but like, better. Um, I did pick up Genshin Impact. I haven't actually played it, but I do have it like downloaded, basically. Give Shane a secret gift. Hot Pepper. Oh, so it's you. Ah, uh, Hot Pepper, thanks. That's it? You love Hot Peppers, what the hell? What's Harvey got for me? I hope it's coffee I can give right back to him. It's a Thursday, right? It has the best graphics I've ever seen and it's free. I mean, two things I can't complain about. Hi, Paul. I'm your secret gift giver this year. Here, open it. Okay. Hope it's a prismatic shard. An emerald. Okay, that's a nice thought. Thanks for the money. It's not much, but I hope you like it. Appreciate it, Harvey. And... Okay, we are done at the Feast of the Winter Star. Let's make like a tree and get the heck out of here. So yeah, I'll try it um, soon. I'm trying to think of when I'm going to try it. I need to... Um, here's the thing. I'm going to be spending most of my time <laughs> for the rest of my life, apparently. Uh, over the weekend. Are you going to stream it? I don't know. Because here's the thing. Like, I'm going to keep doing Stardew until Stardew's done. And then what I might do to... I might, um... Turn that off. I might say... I should have a duck feather. I'm, I'll probably get, I'm probably going to do a Hitman stream again um, when I'm done to get to treat myself, basically. Uh, ancient fruit... Oh, crap. Um, so I'll probably do that. Um, and after that, then I'll have... So it's, I mean, it's going to be a while, is what it comes down to. It's going to be a while before I stream it. But I will make sure I check it out one way or another. Uh, okay, that's good. That, what? Yeah, we're good. Okay. Uh, okay. Do I happen to have an ancient fruit in here somewhere? I do. Why haven't I planted this? Answer me that. There we go. Okay, that's going to take a month. Uh, that's okay. We've got it. That's all that matters. Um, I think that's it. I should just go and start selling stuff. Oh, and I should sell some... Ooh, yeah. I gotta sell my star fruit. Like, all of it. I gotta sell all... I mean, I'll keep... How many kegs do I have in here? Can I take a... Uh, I can almost count it. Okay, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So it's 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. So I will... As much as it pains me. I will keep 40 because I'm not going to be able to refill those kegs before the next batch is done. But I really need a bit of cash right now. So let me sell the rest of these. And everything else I can think of to sell. So let's sell the star fruit, sell the mixed seeds, sell the clay, the nautilus shell. I think, I don't need any sea urchins, do I? No. Uh, I do need coral, but I think I have it already. Don't think, don't, don't need any oysters? No. Uh, sell the ornamental fan, sell the trilobite. How many maple syrups do I need? Two. I've got more than two already, I guarantee you that. Hopefully, and I'll get more. Uh, we're going to sell the cheese. I need the money. Sell the crocuses. We're going to get rid of the salmon berry. I might throw those crystal fruits in their preserve jars. Oh, they won't be done before I get the money from them. I should just sell them. Let's just sell it. We gotta make some money. Uh, the goat cheese, uh, how many do I get per week? I need four per week. I don't quite get four per week. 
Um, but I'm going to be, I'm, how far along am I with Robin? Oh, I've maxed out Robin already. So the only person I'm giving, and I've maxed out Leah, sell the goat cheese. Sell the goat fromage. In fact, this stuff gets sold as well. Um, that's good. Who else have I maxed out? The wizard? George, Evelyn. Evelyn, I was just giving flowers to. I was giving tulips to. Demetrius, Robin, Lewis was hot peppers, but I can give those to Shane. How far am I along with Shane? Oof, I still got three arts to go. Um, if I can get Linus maxed out with coconuts. Um, I can get a second cell coconuts. Doing well with Krobus, that's good to see. Need to make sure I keep giving Krobus loved gifts and the dwarf. Oh, I could give the dwarf a gift. Let's give the dwarf something. Uh, let's give the dwarf another topaz. Uh, don't sell the topaz. Uh, selling the goat cheese, though. Uh, let me check my coral situation. I need 10. Pretty sure I have 10 somewhere. I think. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so we've got, in fact, if I do that, that's ten right there. Perfect. This cheese, I must just have this for gifts, but I've got apricot for just regular light gifts. I'm going to sell the cheese. The beer will be good to sell once I get Pam and Shane maxed out. And I th haven't I maxed out Pam already? Not quite. We're, we're close, though. Okay, let's quickly run up to... The mine. What do we need for emeralds? Do I need emeralds for anything? No. Am I keeping them for gifts? Must be gifts. That's weird. Uh, so Clint, Dwarf, Emily, Penny. But they sell for 250 I don't know if I'm gemologist. Am I gemologist or am I... What, what is that? Artisan, prospector... Okay, well, I'm not Jamal, just one way or another. So they sell for 250 Huh. But, better, I mean, cheaper than a diamond for Penny, though. Yeah, I'll keep the emeralds. The emeralds will be good for gifts. Okay, there's an emerald. I've got 15 emeralds. That's good. Um, so this is at the gifting chest, except for some of that random stuff I have in there. Uh, this is... Oh, I might... I wonder if I can get to Krobus in time, too. Wait, have I given Krobus two gifts this week already? Where's Krobus? Nope, just the one. All right, you know what? Let's do it. Today's the perfect day to do that. So we'll give Krobus a void egg. We're going to give the dwarf a gift. Um, it's 11.30. I don't even know who else would even, who else would be around. Like, who's going to be at the at the saloon right now? Uh, Emily would be at the saloon. Am I giving Emily two gifts this week? No. Hmm. Okay, you know what? Let's do this. Let's just take a bunch of stuff to the saloon. Um, take something for Clint. Take a topaz for Emily. Uh, speaking of Clint, does Clint love topazes? He does. I might just burn through these topazes. Topazes. Um, got some apricots. Who else might be there? Leah might be there, but I think we've maxed out Leah. Or we're close. Have we maxed out Leah? I can't even remember. Ugh. Yes, we have. Okay. Who else might be there? Um, uh, Marnie probably won't. Linus obviously won't. Pam. Potentially Pam. Pam might be there. Might be able to catch Pam on the way home. Maybe. I'm not sure what time she goes home. <clears throat> uh, the wizard. I can get... These Void Essence don't need to be in here anymore. Uh, Sam and all them. Yeah, I could take a cactus fruit, see if I find Sam. Uh, I'll take a hot pepper for Shane. Um, Robin won't be there. Okay, this is a good amount. Let me see if I can quickly... This might be triple shot time. Let me see if I can get over to the saloon before everybody leaves. And 
we'll see if I find anybody. Hoping to find Clint, hoping to find Emily, hoping to find Shane, Pam. Um, right, it's a festival day, so nobody's here. Okay, never mind. Let's go see Krobus. Krobus gets the void egg. There you go. We gotta get... I mean, giving these uh, high-quality gifts is making a big difference. Um, okay. Now we'll quickly head up to the mine. And maybe let's throw some stuff in the furnaces and... Uh, um, and then what? Oh, give the dwarf a gift. That's the whole reason we're going there. I don't know why I torment myself with these artifact spots. Like, what are the odds I'm actually going to get something decent? The answer is very slim. Two copper ore. Nice. Take that. Alright, quickly to the mines. Ooh, look at all the fancy bars. I don't know if I'm going to have time to, uh... To replace everything and make it home. But you know what? What the hell? Let's try it. Um, that's actually not. I only have three coal, so never mind. Oof. Rough. Okay, back to the bus stop. Should be fine. I can sell a couple things on the way. Sell the crocus at least. Okay, so we're going to sell the crocus. Sell the snow yam. We want to keep the seed, the tree seeds. Uh, we'll sell the winter roots. Should have left the copper ore behind. That's okay. Okay, well that was about as good of a good of a day as uh, we could hope for there. It's not gonna really get much better. And we made 120 grand. Nice. I needed that. Most of it, star fruit. <laughs> made 120 grand. 107 of it was star fruit. Sweet. Or 130 grand, actually. Okay, good thing I sold that. So what I should do now is basically go buy as many... Oh, hey, I passed a million gold in total earnings. Sweet. Uh, I should probably go to the desert and um, buy more starfruit seeds. That's what I should probably do. Albacore. Gus wants an albacore. I have an albacore somewhere, don't I? I feel like I have an albacore somewhere. There it is. Is this the last one I need? Yep, sweet. Okay, <clears throat> that is excellent. Drop some stuff in there. We almost have 2,000 wood, so that's good. So I'm basically going to be spending my money. Oh, crap. Hmm. <laughs> I might have to wait on the starfruit seeds because I might need to spend my money right now on copper and coal. Um, because I'm really short on coal and copper. So I might need to spend my money on that. How much coal do I need for things? 55. Dang. Okay. Um, that's unfortunate. Either way, let's prep some gifting. So, Marnie, Linus, Pam, not going to see Sandy. So Marnie gets, does Marnie love anything else that's like cheaper than a diamond? Doesn't she love emeralds or something? No, farmer's lunch, pumpkin pie. She gets, so Marnie gets a diamond. Uh, Shane gets a hot pepper. Who loves blueberry tarts? I know I, I've been asking this a lot. I feel like I've been asking it a lot lately. Blueberry tart. Linus loves a blueberry tart. Let's give him that. Saves him inventory space. We'll take a coconut for Haley. Um, I want to make sure I don't give gifts to people I don't need to give give gifts to. Uh, so no Leah. We can give something to Vincent. Give something to Sam. 
So Vincent, I don't think I have anything that Vincent loves anymore. Because he just loves like snails and stuff. Uh, where's Vincent on my list? Vincent loves... I'm not giving him a ginger ale. I don't have any grapes left. don't have any snails. Uh, do I have a grape? Do I still need grapes for anything? No. I don't need grapes for anything. So if I have a grape anywhere, I can give him a grape. I have a grape. Uh, okay. Have a, I have a suspiciously large number of coconuts, too. I feel like I don't need that many coconuts. I need 14. 11... 14, so I can sell those to, or use them for gifts, I guess. And gift those to Haley, so we can get that friendship up faster. Okay, so we've got a beer for Pam. We've got Topaz for, say, like, Clint uh, and Emily. Blueberry tart for Linus. Cactus fruit for Sam. Hot pepper for Shane. Uh, grape for Vincent. Albacores for the quest for Gus. Coconuts for Haley. Uh, Jody. What does Jody love? I might just give Jody a diamond. I think she loves diamonds. She does love a diamond. Shine bright like a diamond. Let's give her a diamond. Uh, so that's Jody. Okay, so that's Marnie. Jazz. I don't have anything for jazz, do I? Because I think she loves kind of weird stuff too, I feel like. Yeah, fairy rolls, pink cake, plum pudding. Okay, so she's just going to get an apricot. So let's see, that's going to be... That will take care of Leah, Jazz, Marnie, Shane, Jody, Sam, Vincent. I'm like going through all the houses to think. Uh, Haley and Emily. Don't need to worry about Linus. Don't need to... Alex. Need something for Alex. Gets an apricot. Uh, Pierre, Abigail, Caroline. What does Pierre love? Fred Calamari. You get nothing. Abigail gets an amethyst, I think. Yeah, we're going to take an amethyst for Abigail. Caroline. Uh, nothing. Okay, I need to get some tea leaves from her, actually. I wonder if I can. I should check for tea leaves real quick. I still need to make a, tr a tea thing, don't I? I need to like craft a tea sapling. But I think to get this, I need Caroline's... Oh. Wild seed. I can craft the tea sapling. Five fiber, five wood. Have I not done tea sap... What? Really? Have I not crafted a tea, a tea sapling already? Where is it? Or do I just not have two hearts with Caroline? That would be weird. Oh, no, there it is. I haven't done that yet. Okay, well, I guess I should have kept my garden pot. Um, unless I still have it somewhere. Do I have it somewhere? Probably not. Oh, I do. Sweet. Okay. So let me grab five wood, five fiber, and two uh, winter seeds, which I guess... Crap. <laughs> um... Crap, I've been selling everything. I don't think I have. I guess I could check the greenhouse and see if I have any seeds there. Hmm. Sad. Alright, well, let's do the animals, I guess, while I'm here. Was I keeping the dinosaur egg? I want another dinosaur egg for... Oh, the missing bundle. That's what it was. Yeah, at some point I'll do the missing bundle. Don't know when exactly, but we'll do it at some point. Um, what else? How can I get my hands on some mixed seeds? That is the question. Uh, no, we want to make... Actually, I want to put both of these in now to make cheese, because I have all the... I'm not keeping goat cheese anymore. I'm, I'm just selling it all. Uh, so I may as well just keep selling all the cheese. I may as well just make that a thing. Oh! 
Winter seeds, nice. How many do I need? Let's just take all 30. Uh, let's craft a tea sapling. Nice. All right, we've done the tea sapling. Let's mark that off my list. And we're going to pop this inside the house. And everybody wins. All right. I'm not going to bother about with the fruit cave today. I will, however, make my coffee. Uh, or will I? I should probably keep some of these coffee seeds out, or coffee beans out. Um, in fact, I need to kind of keep 12, I guess, right? Yeah, I need 12. Hey, what's up, Belgian Waffle? How are you doing? What is up? How is stuff? Those can all go in there. How goes it? Um, not bad. Was that convincing? How's it going? Um, not bad. It's not bad. Um, yeah, it's going all right. It's going all right. We're we're gonna get through it. We're gonna get through it. I kind of, you know, did some putting of the cart before the horse at, uh, at times, but other than that, we'll be fine. What am I here for? Oh yeah, I'm dropping these guys off so I can plan those later. I uh, had a good stream yesterday, now I'm excited to get my emotes into my chat for tomorrow. Nice. That's awesome. That's sweet, man. That's sweet. I'll look forward to seeing what your emotes are. I believe in you. I should keep, she'll keep prayers open. Thank you. Good, I need them. Uh, okay. What am I doing? Crap, I have the milk pail on me. Why do I have that? do that a lot too or just waste a lot of time walking back and forth because I'm forgetful okay so gifting uh, so I've got stuff for who uh, do I not have stuff for that's something for Clint already what have I missed so far oh not much the first day I played was a bit of a waste of a day because it was a, a festival day so it kind of like skips you through to the end of the day at the end of the day, so we didn't really get to do a lot. But today I'm trying to make up the difference. Um, Vincent, Clint, Jody, Jazz, Crobus, we're done with. Gus, we want to give Gus a diamond. Willie gets mead. All right. Gotcha. Yeah, it was, it was one, of those, one of those festival days. So now I'm trying to get my gifting done, so I don't have to worry about that anymore. I can just focus on making money in the second year. We have a beer for Shane. Caroline just gets an apricot. Alex gets an apricot. Pierre gets an apricot. Emily gets a topaz. Harvey gets a coffee that I should have on me. I don't. I do now. I'm actually going to try and gift absolutely everybody today. Maru gets a diamond. Uh, Sebastian gets a frozen tear. Abigail gets an amethyst. We'll grab a frozen tear for Sebastian. Um, Haley gets coconut. Penny gets an emerald. I think. Elliot gets whatever I have. Uh, apricot. I'll just take diamond for Penny as well. Her Harvey the Wonder Hamster. He doesn't bite, he doesn't squeal, he just runs around on his hamster wheel. Okay, let's do this. First stop, Marnie, who I believe gets a diamond. I'm gonna screw this up. There's no, absolutely no way I'm gonna keep all these gifts straight. Like, there's just, it's not gonna happen. Uh, okay. What do I have cheese on me? Oh, cutscene. Oh, right. This is the depressing cutscene, or one of the depressing cutscenes. Oh dear. Paul, can you do something? He's out cold. Shane, what's the matter with you? All you do anymore is mope around your room and drink beer. 
Oh, here comes Jazz. Time to scar her for life. You wouldn't understand. I'm worried. What's your plan? Don't you ever think about the future? Plan? Where we're going, we don't need plan. Hopefully I won't be around long enough to need a plan. Oh, didn't see Jazz there, did you? The future? Pfft. What future? Okay, that was depressing. All right, so quickly, Marnie gets that. Need to make sure I talk to Jazz before she leaves. What am I giving Jazz again? Oh, I think I'm just giving her an apricot. I don't know how many things she loves. That's for you. Make sure I talk to her as well. Couldn't be me. Uh, hot pepper. Not to exacerbate his alcoholism. She can get the hot pepper. <clears throat> I heard... The CEO of Twitch recently was tweeting some stuff, and he said, um, what do you say? Plans are useless. Planning is important. Which I thought was an interesting, uh, interesting take on that. Uh, okay, let's stop in. We're going to give Jody a diamond. That's for thing, Sam, but that's for Vincent. All right. That's bizarre. I mean, it's a fair point. Plans are useless, because when, I mean, plans rarely, if ever, actually come together. But planning is important. I think the point is, like, don't get too attached to your to your plans. There's Harvey. Um, don't get so attached to your plans that you can't, you know, adapt or improvise or whatever. Um, I for keep forgetting about Ginger Island. Uh... Move, move, I gotta get to those people. Move. Okay, there's Demetrius. What am I giving Demetrius? I'm not. Maru gets a diamond. I know I've given her a gift. I'm trying to talk to her. And we're gonna give Abigail an amethyst. Okay, uh, there's Lewis. I don't care. Um, thought I'd be gonna talk to him because I've maxed out the friendship. Uh, we've got to give Alec... Oh, there goes Emily. She gets a topaz. Um, let's see if Haley's at home. Oh, cutscene. Oh, this is the Rock Rejuvenation quest cutscene. Sweet. Great, everyone has their stone. Now close your eyes, take a slow... And take slow, deep breaths. Focus on your lungs gross. Visualize the pure energy flowing into your body with every breath. I'm too busy thinking about like the goopy, um, like the actual flesh of lungs, which is like goopy kind of weird stuff. And when you exhale, feel all the tension and negative energy flowing out, leaving you with more and more, leaving you more and more relaxed with every breath. This stresses me out. Like this is like, this kind of stuff is like, now open your heart to the vibrational frequency of your stone. Do you feel anything? No. <laughs> Thank you, Abigail. Oh, Marnie. Marnie's getting it. Caroline feels relaxed. <laughs> Haley fell asleep. That would be me right there. Just conk out. Looks like the gemstones were put to good use. Were they, though? Were they, actually? There's that's for Haley. I wonder if that's like a closet. Like, what is that? That door to somewhere. Okay, we gotta find Vincent and Sam. Um, is Gus here today? Now let's see if Alex is home. They'll head to the store, see if anyone's in the store. Alex is not here. Okay. The Ginger Island thing is kind of... I worked so hard to try and get the Ginger Island as quickly as possible, and now I have no idea what's going on. Uh, okay, Pierre gets an apricot. Uh, let's go see if I can grab a tea 
from Caroline's plant. Because if I can, if I can get some tea leaves, I can just make her some tea. There she is. Uh, apricot. Oh, I can get tea leaves. Nice. All right, so next time, Caroline gets some tea. I kept forgetting that tea leaves only... You can only get tea leaves from tea plants the last week of the month. There's Jody. I already gave Jody a gift, didn't I? Did I catch Jody at home? I don't know. Let's try it again. Yes, I did. Okay. I got Abigail. So I don't know where Vincent is. Uh, why did I come up here? I guess I could go see if Sebastian's at home, maybe? I don't think I want to go to... Do I want to go to Ginger Island to check for... To give gifts to people? I don't think I do. Uh, let's go find Linus, though. And Willie. Willie. I might be able to find Willie. But let's see if anybody's here. So I'm done with Demetrius. Am I done with Robin? I think I'm done with Robin, too. Yes, I am. I found Maru already. Let's see if Sebastian's in his room. Sebastian, yes. Okay. Uh, so I still have a gift for Willie, Clint, Linus, Pam. Cactus fruit was for Sam. Albacore's for Gus. Let's make sure I do that. Vincent. We've done Crobus already. So let's go see if we can find Linus. And then... Um, Oh, cutscene. Bagging out these cutscenes today, though. Oh, hi, Mark. What? You haven't seen my motorcycle before? Hmm, guess I haven't shown it to you. I mean, that would explain it. Oh. Sometimes after sundown, I take, make the long ride out of Stardew Valley. No, you don't. You smoke by the lake. There's nothing else like it, blazing along the empty stretch of road toward the faint city glow. Once I save, once I've saved up enough money, I'm going to head out on my own to the city and beyond, just me and my bike. And your computer. There we go. Oil's changed. That'd be like me. Just me and my bike. And my computer. Hey, maybe I'll let you ride sometime if you want. Uh, I'm going to assume that that sounds fun is the best uh, the best option. Great. Oh, there's an artifact spot over there. I should grab that. Hopefully Linus is at his tent or something. Come on, Linus. There he is. Sweet. Blueberry tart for Linus. Oh, the beloved farmer. I guess I've got... Maxed out Linus. Sweet. We've maxed out Wizard, George, Evelyn, Demetrius, Robin, Lewis, Marnie as well. Sweet. And Linus. Awesome. That's very, very, very good. Okay, let's go to the bus. Ham should be at the bus. I'll go this way, because this way will probably be faster. At some point, I need to clean out the quarry as well, actually. Now that I think about it. Uh, bus stop. Is Pam here? Yes, she is. Pam gets a beer. We're not going to um, kind of push Shane towards further alcoholism, but we will push Pam. I'll tell you that. Pam gets all of the beer. Clint is not here. There's Caroline. We've given her a gift already. Do I need to ship a tea, just like a regular old tea? No, I need to ship tea leaves. Hmm. Getting the lady sloshed. No, Pam ain't. Uh, Pam is not an after-dinner thing, if you know what I mean. And Pam could drink anybody out of the table. How romantic. Yeah, Pam could... Uh, there's Willie. Willie gets some mead. Uh, yeah, Pam's drinking everybody under the table. There's no question there. Oh, I need to give Gus the albacore. Uh, I'm not going to spend a thousand gold to go to Ginger Island for anything right now. 
Um, I don't need to go to Ginger Island until... Actually, I should check. I was going to check last time and I forgot. Let me go to the crop planner. So the 22nd... I think I planted Ginger Island on the 22nd. So assuming that the 1st is the 22nd. And assuming I plant a star fruit on the 1st. It finishes... 20 seconds, so if, so if it's here, it goes, or no, if it's here, it goes down, the, it'll finish on the 7th of spring. So what I'm going to do is write down that on spring 7, uh, ginger island star fruit is done, in theory. So we shipped the Nautilus shell, sold that, did that, doing the gifting, okay, that looks good. Uh, okay, let's go give the albacore to Gus. That will finish that quest. Mark him one more thing off my list. And I'm kind of just giving up on Vincent, I guess. Vincent, Sam. They might have gone to Ginger Island. I'm thinking that's probably what it was. There's Shane. We gave Shane something. There's Sam. Uh, Sam gets a cactus root. There we go. Let me just see if Vincent's at home now, because maybe he didn't go to the drought. If his mom is here, and Sam's here, where the heck would Vincent be? In the library? I didn't check the library. But normally he'd be there with Jazz, and Jazz wasn't at the library, was he? I have no idea. No clue. What up, Gus? You should turn off the island resort if you are doing heart maxing. Can you do that? What up, Crypto Green? Oh, Albacore. Uh, Gus. Albacore. Nine. There we go. Okay, that one's done. Lovely. I'll uh, mark that off my list. Uh, that's this one right here. Fish do. Beautiful. Uh, okay, this is good. This is, uh... I feel like I've done some of this other stuff. Like, this Pierre's notice. Oh, whoops, hold on. Uh, quest. Story quest. Where is it? Pierre's Notice. Oh no, it's Spring Year 2. Okay. I keep thinking, I've, I feel like I've done more of these, but I mean, I, I, I guess I haven't. Um, one thing I will check real quick, because obviously today is basically a write-off. Uh, let's look at the secret notes. Show details. Left to read, left to find. So I have found these notes, but not read them. That seems not quite right. I've read every secret note I've found, so clearly... Scrolling guys, I've done that. I did not need to open all those tabs. So 11 is just that. 13. Right. Oh, for a Junima plush. I don't really care about that. Um... At noon on the last day of the season, interact with the bush located above the playground to obtain it. I don't think I care. 15, during the NARP. Oh! I forgot about the pearl at the mermaid show at the night market. Whoops. Okay. Um, no, oh, head to the area north of Georgia Mart next to the river and dig farthest north tile on the east side to get the strange doll. I should do that. I should do that right now. I don't think I'd make it back to the museum in time, but... Make a try. So the northernmost tile on the east side... East side? No. Uh, there's Alex, and there's Robin. I've maxed out Robin. I don't think I gave Alex a gift, did I? Have I maxed out Alex this week? Perhaps not. Why? Oh, Alex would have been at the spa. That's what it was. I still don't know where Vincent was. Maybe I should check the... Uh, get back here. Don't you want to rave me? Came all the way through the snow to see you? No. Okay, secret notes. Um, <clears throat> 18. Hey, Paul. Hey, what's up, Arctic Wolf? 
How goes it? Me, I'm good. Thinking of getting a return ticket to Kelowna, 318, five, five days, four nights. Wow. Nice. That seems pretty good. That's sweet. Yeah, let me know if you're my way. We should meet for beat up. I guess. I don't know. <laughs> um, I'm actually going to be in Kelowna Friday. I have, a, I have an appointment with a specialist that I couldn't get one. I couldn't. There was a specialist in Kamloops, um, but the wait list was like two years. And the wait list for the person in Kelowna was two weeks. So I thought, let's go with this two, two, two weeks. Um, I'm starting to think that I haven't actually done these. They're, they're now $50 tickets too. Nice. Two years. Yeah. They're just, <clears throat> I think the problem is that there aren't some, I was, the doctor I was talking with said that I should see a sports person for my shoulder. Um, and there's no, and the sports specialist that she was going to send me to in Kamloops, the waitlist is two years. And so ended up just sort of saying, like, do you want to go to Kelowna? And I'm like, no, but I will. Um, anyways, yeah. What do you do? All right, it's five o'clock. Vincent's not going to be here. I don't know why I bothered. Um... I guess I could check his house. By now he's got to be at his house, right? Like, because who do I have left? I got the grape for Vincent. I've got, uh, and that's literally it. A diamond for who, do I, who am I missing here? Uh, pretty sure I gave Jody a gift already. Did I find Clint? I don't know if I found Clint. I must have though. I don't have the. Oh no, I do have a topaz yet. Maybe for Clint. Okay, the Topaz might be for Clint. Um, then Crobus, Willie, Shane, Caroline, um, Pierre, Maru we did today, Abigail we did today, Penny. Could be for Penny. <clears throat> it could be for Penny. And we didn't see Elliot anywhere today. So if I can find... There's Elliot. Okay, uh, let's try and find Vincent. We'll try and find Penny. There's Vincent. Get back here, Vincent. Lentil soup. Actually, it does not sound great. Oh, there's Penny. Uh, Penny, 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 Penny. Diamond. Your mother hates squid. Good to know. I won't give her a squid. So we basically just have Clint. And that's like literally we've gifted everybody we could possibly gift today. <clears throat> and hopefully Clint will show up in here. I'm pretty sure he will. There he is. Uh, Clint gets a topaz. And it's his birthday. Sweet. I'm glad that worked out really well. Okay, we got it. That's got to really boost Clint. Ooh, we're at nine hearts. Nice. <clears throat> okay, sweet. So having done that, uh, I will head back to the house. It's Friday. Did not check the traveling cart, but I don't think I care about the traveling cart anymore. Um, I really don't. I mean, I could get by a garlic for 400, but... I don't really need it. I have all the rare crows. No point buying garlic seeds. Millet, blackberry, super meal, gold ore, scorpion, carp, garlic, bug meat, rhubarb seed. Rhubarb seeds. Oof. For 800? Yeah, how about no? How about no? Okay, yeah, so we're not going to do the traveling cart. I mean, the traveling cart is uh, useful, but... Mainly just to, like, complete the community center. I was just looking at a $4.2 million condo in Toronto on YouTube. No, I'm not going to buy it. <laughs> no. Actually, there's a house not too far from where I live um, that I saw um, recently that's on sale in Kamloops for over a million dollars, let's say. Um, and, uh, yeah. 
Oh yeah. Okay, I'm going to, um, I do need to shift these tea leaves. I was thinking I should keep it to give Caroline a green tea, which she loves, but I need to ship the tea leaves, which is more important. Shipping tea leaves. Done. Crap, I need to ship a green tea. So let's ship a green tea first. Let me fix that. Uh, let's go reset and let's find tea leaves. Oof, look at how much stuff we've done. This is so good. Tea leaves, no. There we go. All right, we'll, we'll, we'll leave the tea leaves. We'll, we'll ship a green tea. Actually, I was in position to do that, do that at one point. Nice. I have, have never been in that position. Should I do this right now? I think I will sell these right now just to make sure I get the money for it from them, but I won't refill them until the rest of them are done. Just so I can keep them synced up. Exciting. There we go. 33 will ultimately be 40. Starfruit wine. What's that going to sell for? Um, duh, give me the wiki. Give me literally anything on the wiki. Give me something on the wiki but on a new page though. Star fruit wine will sell for thirty one fifty. So that's gonna be another hundred thousand right there. Is that right? Thirty three thirty ninety. Yeah, be about hundred thousand. Sweet. It's insane how expensive housing is. You are not wrong. Let me tell you something. If I like I mean, I got into the housing market um, right on time, basically. <clears throat> um, like right before it was, sh guess I'll be homeless. Shortly after, shortly, or in the lead up, it was late 2008. So like the housing market was going to, to hell anyways with the, with the great crash of 2008. Um, <clears throat> and leading into leading into that or after that the Canadian government said okay we're going to change the mortgage rules we're going to require like no no more zero down payment mortgages that sort of thing so i managed to sneak in late 2008 right before the government right before i would have had to have a down payment and if i had to come up with a down payment i probably still wouldn't have been able to i probably would still be renting because they keep moving the goalposts, right? Like you save up by the time you have enough saved up for a down payment, the cost of housing has gone up. So I, I kind of like dodged a bullet, uh, with getting into the, getting into the housing game. Um, yeah, that's like a little scary. Just how close I was to n never, never being able to own a house basically. Um, but yeah, it's just one of those things where like you just kind of kind of have to get in by hook or by crook, and then once you're in, then at least you're you're building a little bit of equity, right? Like at least at that point, Ooh, I might just clear this whole area actually. Um, when, once you get to that point, <clears throat> then at least you're building some equity, even if like and, my, and let's be clear, my first mortgage was awful. I was a first time home buyer, right after the housing crash. Um, like no banks wanted to give me anything um finally f finally find a lender um that will give me a mortgage the rate was insane my mor my mortgage payments was just all interest all the time like <sighs> but again the, after the first you know handful of years when i would came time to renew my mortgage then things were a bit more sane so you really have to like suffer through it for for a few years but then after that things kind of get better uh, if only housing were a manipulated market designed to extract wealth from the middle class. Yeah, weren't. Yeah. Um, one time in Toronto, I crashed a t-shirt art show done by an architect who owned the warehouse the tees were displayed within it. I think it was a future development site. Nice. Yeah, it's kind of... Honestly, it's just like... Jimmy Carr tells a joke about how, like... Um talking about you know seeing a sign on the road that says watch for falling rocks he said like what what am i meant to do with that information like it, the sign may as well say 
life's a lottery, be lucky. Um, and I think about that a lot because honestly, it's it's kind of very much that. I never went into here actually. I should do this with mine real quick. Um, it's very much like a, you know what? Hey, be lucky. Okay. Oh, what? You're 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 broke. Have you tried being born rich? Oh, you haven't tried being born rich? Well, joke's on you, because you should have tried being born rich. Now, I can't remember exactly what's where in this mine. Is it worth going anywhere? I don't think so. I kind of just need to, like, power my way to the end and get the golden side and get out. Wow, there's a lot of skull faces up there, though. That's not great. And not a lot for my, re not a lot for my effort, either, like... Whoops. It's like what, like one copper and one iron? That's not great. Um, they take as much as they can, I'm afraid to say. Yeah. Do you understand that one? Which one? The joke? Or the... Future development site. All right, let's just let's just carry on. Cannot look at life as a lottery. Oh, I see. Kind of is though. Like, <laughs> that's the thing. It's like. I'm gonna let these guys. I'll wait. Just you're gonna you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna come close to my fist at some point. Uh, I'm nearly dead. Hopefully I don't actually die. Got the golden side. Okay, fortunately, I've never actually done that before. I've never actually teleported, um, away from there. I saw somebody else do it one time. Yeah, fortunately it worked, because if it hadn't, I'd be dead right now. Um... All right, let's let's go. <laughs> Anyways, bust up. The good news is, I mean, the good news is at least like at least there are there are more things now that more people can make more money with. So like you know, if you were, if you're willing to take the risks, of course, but. Um, so, for example, I had purchased some shares in GameStop. Like, not many, like five or something like that. But, I mean, they've doubled in value since I bought them. So, Or, like, more than doubled in value since I bought them. So, it's like, there are options that you have now that, like, more people are looking at more things. More people are looking at the markets. Cryptocurrency, um, for example. I mean, maybe not in May. Cause the price kind of tanked in May, but... Um, but it's things like that, where it's like, more people have more options to make more money now, um, that kind of aren't the mainstream things, which is kind of what needs to happen if, um, if, uh, you know, anyone's going to make any money, if any sort of people in the, of the middle class are going to be able to make any money, it's very much going to be something unconventional like your cryptocurrency like your meme stocks like whatever uh dad was had a stuck in a ghetto per se when the mortgage rates were at credit card interest he could have managed it but the bank figured not he chose to invest the money not a bad idea nice another hundred and five thousand. okay so it is the 27th of winter i need to make sure i buy copper before the end of the month. I don't think I'll need to buy wood. I think I'll be okay for wood. Um, but I do need to buy copper. On one of those screens I showed you was good for 40,000 copies. <laughs> nice. Cranberry sauce. Large mouth. Cranberries. Can I make cranberry sauce? 
I can make cranberry sauce. Does somebody love a cranberry sauce? This is a question that we should be asking ourselves repeatedly. No, okay. So the cranberry sauce, I can go in the chest outside. Oh, I should mark it off my list too. We have cooked um, cranberry sauce. Nice. All right. Cranberry sauce. Uh, the large mouth. I don't think I need any more large mouths. I need a large mouth or something? Must be a recipe. Crispy base. Bass. Crispy bass. Uh, but I probably already have one inside. Let's double check. Just sat down there for no reason. Um... Seriously? That was fortuitous. All right, we have our large mouth. Uh, good. I need to swing by the mines and drop off all this ore and stuff. Uh, I'm going to... I'll let the stuff sit for a day. Um, just to kind of continue to try and sync things up a little bit. I should probably check the hay situation. Ah, uh, you know what? I may not need to check the hay situation. Because we're we have two days left in winter. So I probably, I'm probably going to be good. Probably going to be all right. Uh, is there anybody I should be gifting today? Uh, Sandy. Uh, Sam. Jody. Caroline. Pierre. Did I mark off that I shipped a green tea? Did I mark that? I did not. There we go. Green tea has been shipped. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna do some gifting today as well, I think. I don't think the... I must the gold yesterday, right? I must have done, because I've got gold, gold cheats right there. Okay. This is good. This is this cheese is gonna be a nice little boost to the finances. Quick check in here. Uh, oh yeah, apricots, gotta grab them. And let's start, how many garlic seeds do I have? I've got nine. Ten, I only need eleven though, right? Garlic, twelve. Okay, so I do need to put, I was hoping to get away with this, but I do need to put... I'll, I'll put them both in the, uh, actually, wait, do I need to like ship a garlic or something? No, I've already shipped a garlic. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll stick them both in the seed maker. Why not? I'm not going to hurt to have extras. Okay. Uh, we will check the fruit cave because why not? Nothing. All right. Let's see if we can finish up gifting for the week. And then, uh, again, I just need to start, keep gathering wood and stuff. So, wood. Sweet, we do have 2,000 wood now. Okay, gifts. Who am I giving gifts to? I've forgotten already. We are giving gifts to... Uh, Sam. Sam and Jody. All right. Sam and Jody. Uh, Foo Fighter tickets went on sale today for Madison Square Garden 375 each June 20th. Nice. That'd be a, I'd love to see the Foo Fighters live. That'd be a good show. It's so cool. The, th the thing I like, the, you want to know what I like the most about that? It's the fact that things are getting back to normal. You know what I mean? Like things are like, every time I think about things getting back to normal, that makes me happy. You know, like me, being able to meet, I'll be meeting up with my dad in Vancouver here. We talked about that sometime in July. We're going to go down to Vancouver. Me too. Yeah. Um... I'm just so glad that things are getting back to normal. It's so exciting. All right, sell the goat cheese, sell the mayonnaise, sell the sap, sell the cheese. Okay, do not need 97 pine cones. Um, okay, so Jody and Sam. Who else am I giving gifts to? 
uh, Caroline be an apricot. Pierre will be an apricot. Maru, I can give Maru another diamond. Or what else would you like? I'll just give her a diamond. She's gonna be getting a lot of diamonds. At some point, I need. I, uh, at some point, I need to. I need to get to to. Um, At some point, I really need to get back to the desert and do another Skull Cavern run. But, I'm going to need more sprinklers for crops in the spring. <sighs> oh, I'm so far behind right now. I kind of just need to treat year two like a money run. In some ways. Just like, you know what? You, you're not, I'm not going to have all the sprinklers I want. I'm not going to have all of the crops I want. But, I should be able to have a lot of it fairly quickly in spring because I do have stuff on Ginger Island. Maybe I should maybe I should finish Ginger Island up. Well no, I'll wait until I can plant it all at the same time. Um spring crops is rhubarb. But I'm not gonna have a lot of spring I'll have to just make I'm gonna have to just not make kegs right away. I'm gonna have to just focus on like the kegs I have I'm have, gonna have to just treat as a bonus and just focus on making more sprinklers because I need I could use another 50, 60 sprinklers, but I only have, I could make not 50 or 60 right now. I could make uh, 32 as long as I didn't want to have any more kegs. But maybe I make 32 sprinklers and then use my copper for tappers. And then hopefully by the time, you know, by the time I get a crop or two done, hopefully by now I'll be, I'll have a bit more resources again and I can make some kegs. That's a thought. That is a thought. I have to think about that. I have a day to decide, which isn't great, but anyways. Uh, okay, let's focus on gifting for today. Uh, so we got down to Maru in my list. Uh, there she is. Um... Abigail, we'll give her an amethyst, and that's it. I'm not going to get to the desert to the island today. Does somebody love an aquamarine? I know I, I asked this question last time. Aquamarine. Clint, Dwarf, Emily. All right, that's good. I want to get rid of those. I don't even, I don't even have them around. So, what are we gifting? Jody, Sam, Maru, uh, uh, Abigail, uh, Caroline, and Pierre. And I can't remember if that's it. Uh, it might be it. Hopefully that's it. Okay. So let's go find... Right. Let's go find... Uh, took me a second, but I got there. Let's go find Jody and Sam. Put a diamond up there as well. Let's not give Vincent a diamond this time. Sam's not home. Jody is. Where is Sam at 9 o'clock in the morning? Oh, you know what? Doesn't he work at the museum now? I feel like he works at the museum now. Oh, there's Vincent. Wait. No, we can't. We're done with Vincent. Uh, we're done with, uh, oh, there's Sam. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, um, Abigail, Caroline, Pierre, hopefully they're all home. Oh, a quest. Crocus for Sam. Nice. Yes, I will do that. Oh, cutscene. Stop telling me how to live my life. You're not my real mom. Cut it out. We're letting you live here free of charge until you finish school. It doesn't seem, it seems like you don't appreciate that at all. Stop trying to make me feel guilty. I appreciate that you and Dad are helping me out, but expecting me to dress the way you want is ridiculous. I'm not a little girl anymore, Mo Mom. You're right. I'm sorry. Is someone there? I swear this house is haunted. Abigail? Caroline, Caroline. Uh, 
and Pierre. Okay. Um, who else do I need to give a gift to? Maru. I think that's it, actually, isn't it? I think either I've maxed out friendship, or I've except for Sandy and Leo and stuff. Uh, maxed out Leah. Just Maru. Yeah, just Maru. Unless I want to go to the desert and Ginger Island. And I don't. So let's go see. I should just look and see where Maru is, so I'm not messing around here. Um, Maru on a Saturday in winter. She's in the lab at home until 2 p.m. All right. There's Sebastian. There's Alex going up to the spa. This is really good, actually. The friendship has really come together at the end of the year. I mean, it's taken to the end of the year, but... Um, it's actually kind of coming together a little bit. Hey, have a nice walk. No. Okay, great. That's done. So we've we actually maxed out our gift, except for Sandy and Leo. We've maxed out our gifting this week. So, with the money I have, um, I should probably go buy some copper right now. Because if I do have money left over, I would like to buy some crops. But I can't I can't just buy copper, I'll need to buy coal as well. Cause I've got like well I need fifty just for crafting stuff. Fifty-five, and I have eleven here, twenty-seven at home. I have to buy coal as well. Weak. Okay, well, um I actually have a decent amount of copper there. How much copper do I really want? Well, ultimately, I'm going to want to have... Actually, you know what? Hold on a second. Let me think about this here. Uh, quarry. Does this show me... Uh, let's see here. There's a, a picture somewhere that shows, like, the optimal layout if you're going to put kegs in the quarry. Here. It's basically something like this. This is quarry filled with kegs. 254 kegs. 98, 81. Oh, no, 374 kegs in the quarry. In a perfect world, I would have kegs all, of, all through the quarry and in the tunnel and on the, on the road. Um, and I'd have a fully upgraded house and have the house full of kegs. And probably the mountain road as well. I have done a, a run where I had a thousand or like 1200 kegs, I think. Um, but that was also on the normal farm map. And you kind of need to have that many kegs if you're going to keg everything that you harvest. But I think it's something like, if you go with crops that take two weeks to grow, you need to have one keg for every three crops you harvest or something like that. Um, and then that will actually that way you can keep keg you can keep your kegs full all year round. Top tip. So, however, a I'm on the forest farm, so I don't have that many. I don't have anywhere near as many um, farmable spots. B. This isn't actually a money run. I only need to make twelve. Well, I only need to spend like fifteen million, somewhere around fifteen million. Um, 10 million for the clock, then a bunch of obelisks, which I think are like two, four, two, three, four, maybe four million, somewhere there. So really like four, between 14 and 15 million is what I need to spend on stuff. Never mind like, you know, tool upgrades and <laughs> tickets to Ginger Island and stuff. Um, so... How much copper do I need to buy? Probably not that much right now. Because what I really need to do is make sprinklers. That needs iron, gold, and refined quartz. All the copper. I mean, I... So here's the problem. I do kind of need all the copper. Because ultimately, I'm, I am going to need it for kegs. But how many kegs? Maybe I just plan for like 400 kegs or something. Fill the quarry. 
and have some in the house. Maybe I plan for another... Well, what did that picture say again? So this picture says 374 kegs in the quarry. I will write, this one says 254 kegs, so I'm not sure which is which, but... Um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 100. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 200. 210, 220. Um, 20, 30, 40, 50. Call it 60, call it 70, call it 80, call it 90, call it 300. So if I were to plan for 300 more kegs, good gravy, I still can't afford it. I still can't afford that much copper. Because um, 300 more kegs, that's, well, that's like 1,500 copper right there just for that 300 kegs. That's 1,500 copper. No, not 1,500 copper. It's 5 times 3 is 50. If it's 1,500 copper. Um, plus coal. Plus iron and coal to smelt the iron as well. So I kind of need to... I think I kind of need to like build up to it a little bit. I think I need to... Um, I will go buy some stuff right now for sure, but uh, I I really need to like keep things fairly balanced. So here's what we're gonna do. I really want to upgrade my tools too, but I don't really I can't really go without them right now. Okay, how much do we want to how much do we want to spend? If I were to spend like seventy five thousand, wait a second. I could totally buy 1,500 copper right now. I've got the money for it. That's 100,000. I've got 200,000. So I could totally buy all the copper I need. However, coal is 150 a piece. And 150 times 300 is another 45,000. So we add that to the 112, oops. And that's uh, 112, 500. Whoops. That's 157,000 just for copper, not for iron, not for sprinklers, nothing. So maybe I buy the copper Use some of it for tappers. Use some of it for, for... We'll save some of it for kegs. I will gather more in time anyways, I'm sure. I just can't have no... Oh, see, the other problem is I still want to buy crops and stuff. I still want to buy crops and stuff. Because I still want to buy... I still need to buy... Uh, uh, um, oh, crap. I still need to buy star fruit, and I'm gonna to need to buy star fruit in the first week of spring for well, both the greenhouse and ginger island. And I'm gonna to need to buy rhubarb for the regular farm. I've really kind of played myself into a corner here. Um, okay, so let's do this. Let's run some numbers on the rhubarb and the star fruit. Because how many cause Basically, the the copper and the, the kegs and the tappers and stuff, I mean, the copper actually isn't all that, it isn't totally necessary, I don't think. It's kind of necessary. I do need to make money with kegs. Um, but it's not super necessary in the short term. I don't think. Is it kind of necessary? To try? I don't know. This is getting overwhelming here. So I'm going to be planting something like 400 or four or 500 star fruit on Ginger Island. That's the goal. Um, I'm going to be also maybe 
be planting four or five hundred four or five hundred star fruit on Ginger Island. I'm going to be also planting hopefully another eight times ten. Hey, what's up, Blackberry Jam? How you doing? Um, hoping to have like maybe fifty sprinklers at home. So hundred four hundred. So what is say nine hundred? Well, it's four hundred thousand. Essentially, nine hundred times four hundred, which is three hundred sixty thousand. I have no idea how I'm going to do this. Let's buy. Let's not buy fifteen hundred copper. Full. My wife brought some Timmy's home, and I have no self control. <laughs> nice. You and me both, my friend. I was. Uh, I was explaining earlier how, for supper tonight. Diane wanted uh, fajitas, and so, but when we do like fajitas or burritos or whatever, um, I make the tortilla shells from scratch, so they're super tasty, um, but when I make a batch of them, it does tend to get a little bit silly, uh, because... It, the batch I make is actually fairly a fairly large batch, so I just end up eating way too way too many of them. It's fun to make them. It is kind of fun to make them. <clears throat> um, but yeah, I just I just I just eat um, I just eat not all. Hey, what's up, common friends? Um, yeah, if, if, if I just eat it, it's like, hey, do you want this last one? No, do, do you want that? No. And of course, you know, Diane eats like a hummingbird, so I end up eating way too much. Okay, I'm also gonna buy like a hundred. 100, 10, 100. I'll spend like. Here's 100 copper, 100 coal, 200 coal, 300 coal. Let me try and keep like 100,000 in cash. Wait. Did I screw that up? Rhubarb seeds. The good news is I can sell starfruit to make money to get more starfruit seeds. Rhubarb seeds cost 100 each. I'm going to want to have whatever the heck I said. 400. That's 40,000. 40, 40, 40, 40, 40, 40, 40, 40. Okay, good. So let me buy more coal. Buy some more coal. Let's buy, let's buy. I still do want to keep some money though. There we go. We bought 500 coal, bought 1,000 gold. Bought a thousand and one gold. Bought a thousand gold. Thousand copper. Bought a thousand and one copper. It's killing me on the inside. All right. Well, now we have some coal, so let's go do some smelting. Um, let's smelt the. I had a hundred copper here already. Sweet. Uh, but we need it all. Okay, let's throw in. Gold. Uh, I should probably also throw in some quartz as well. Let me put all four of these guys in. And then we'll put gold in the rest. Okay. Okay. We are on our way with that stuff. Uh, while I'm here... Let me run up to the train station. We'll check for trees. Um, the other problem, of course, being that even if I have enough copper and iron and stuff for everything, uh, am I going to have enough oak resin? The answer is probably not. The answer is very much probably not. So... Yeah. Not without tappers. Yeah, I... Yeah. Could have played this better. Uh, definitely could have done a better job. That's okay. Let's go this way, I guess. We'll sell it. I should have picked up those crocuses. On the way by, I need to get a crocus to Sam. That's right. Yes. Thank you guys for reminding me. I need to get a crocus to Sam. That's worth friendship with Sam and like a hundred gold or whatever, but 
the important thing is the friendship with Sam, because the more friendship we do, the less we have to do friendship stuff. Well, let's go find Sam. I wonder where Sam is right now. Let's look and see where Sam is right now. Sam. It is winter. Regular schedule. Let's guitar in his bedroom, goes to the saloon. Okay. So unless he's on Ginger Island. Yeah, I really should do that thing that what's his face said and or what's her face said or what's her face said. Uh, and just shut down the resort on Ginger Island so people stop going there. Cause I really need them to not do that. How dare you people go on vacation when I need to find you for my own purposes. So Sam actually might, assuming Sam's not on Ginger Island, he might be on the way to uh, the saloon pretty soon. I think that's what it said, right? 120 leaves his bedroom, so he should be hopefully right here. Sweet. Uh, this Is this your music in the background? It's really nice. No, it's not my music in the background. You can tell because it's really nice. Um... This is the Stardew Valley soundtrack. The Stardew Valley soundtrack is incredible. It is such a good soundtrack. Um, bang, we maxed out Sam. <laughs> In that case, it sucks! <laughs> no, the, uh, the Stardew Valley music is so good. Like, it's just... Every song is just like... I listen to every song and think, I wish I could make music like that. Every song is great. Where am I going? Quarry. I'm gonna go clear out the quarry a bit more. Technically, I guess I don't really need to. I could just do it as I put kegs down. Um, but I will anyways. You can, I've heard your stuff. Well, thank you, I appreciate it. Okay. Wonder, you know, maybe I should just kind of do this as I go. I mean, I'll grab all the ore and stuff. Yeah, I think I will. You know, I'll grab, I'll grab like the trees. Um, the trees and the gems and the ores and the whatevers. Um, but I think I'll leave the rocks just because I don't really need stone right now and. Um, yeah, I'll just do that. Uh, speaking of music, if anybody wants to hear what will probably be the last song I ever sing. <laughs> so, in a, comp in a moment of complete insanity, I decided to do a song that was kind of like 90s R&B style. Blackberry Jam, this was, sadly, I did this song before... You and I met, so you weren't able to coach me through this one. It was already submitted for distribution by then. Uh, but it comes out on Tuesday. So if you want to hear <clears throat> what, if I have my way, will be the last song I ever, the last recorded song I ever sing. Uh, it comes out Tuesday. It comes out on the, that's the, why am I trying to pickaxe a rock? It comes out on the 15th. <clears throat> Excuse me a moment. Thank you. Uh, and if you're watching this on YouTube, hello. That's probably out already. Okay, so <clears throat> I look forward to hearing it. Eh, reserve judgment. Um, <laughs> okay, so I'm thinking I'm just going to leave this until I actually have kegs. I don't think I care about this to do any more here. It's probably not worth it. Let's swing back to the mart. And let's uh, just add stuff there. Uh, I'm going to make... <clears throat> I need some iron. Because I still need to make sprinklers in like two days. So, let's just throw in some copper. Because I've got it. And let's uh, go get some iron and maybe kill some dust sprites in an attempt to uh, get, um, <laughs> to get the burglar ring that I really desperately need. Okay, your modesty is only surpassed by your... <laughs> By your humility. Too kind, my friend. Too kind. I tend to think of it as being realism. But, I mean, I'm not the one who is... <laughs> Let's just say, while while some people in this chat right now are award-nominated, uh, I am only award-eligible. So, that's my claim to fame. 
my claim to fame is that I am my award eligible song is coming out in two days or whenever that is next week oops that guy just punched me in the face <coughs> Okay. Uh, what's the what's the luck? Oh, I think it's good luck today. I think it's good luck. Okay, let's um. I think it's good luck. I hope it's good luck. <laughs> the funny thing about it is that typically when it's good luck, that means you you encounter fewer baddies. But I need more of the the bouncing furry things uh, because I need to get. Which would actually be super useful in the Skull Cavern too, to be honest with you. I kind of need... Oh, there they are. Come here, let me hit you with my hammer. Thank you. Okay. Anybody else? Yes, sweet. I need so many more of these guys. Actually, I just need so many more of, like, all everything. That's going to be uh, 12 o'clock noon sharp. Last day of the season. Check the bush above the playground. Maybe I will do that tomorrow, just to get it over with. Don't really care for the Junimo plushie, but it's kind of cute. Yeah, there are just so many. <laughs> These monster eradication goals are going to be a challenge. I was hoping to find a ladder... Before I got back to this ladder? Never mind. Okay. <clears throat> Do I have enough copper to throw in right now? Or enough iron? Throw in a few. Uh, let's grab some more copper. Uh, it's, uh, it's, uh, copper. That's what it's called. It took me a second, but I got there. So, um, <clears throat> for those of you keeping score, OpenBSD experiments will continue after probably after the stream tonight. My my Twitch bot is not going to work for a while. Um, for, for people who just hang out in my chat when I'm not streaming and just use the bot. Um, but yes, I am going to attempt. Well, let's just say I'm still doing I'm still discovering right now. I'm still discovering if it's feasible, but the plan ultimately is to switch operating systems that I'm running my bot. Right now I'm running my bot on a on a Linux box, a Linux laptop uh, in the closet to my right. Um I was thinking about trying to switch to OpenBSD because I'm a glutton for punishment. So I'll be playing with that um this weekend. Hopefully it comes together quickly. But I have to move my entire... Like, the good news is I, I have a computer I can mess around on. So the computer I'm, I'm keeping an eye on chat, that I'm using to keep an eye on chat. That was not my hammer. Oh my goodness, I'm getting... Okay, now I'm just... Now I don't know what I'm doing. There we go. Um, is an OpenBSD laptop that is also in the closet to my right. Um... So fortunately, I can kind of use that as my test bed. I know you all care. So the plan is to kind of do some testing on there, make sure I can do things like, you know, run my file server, which shouldn't be a problem. That'll be easy to test. Make sure I can run my Stardew Perfection tracking website. Make sure that's all going to work. Um, that sort of thing. Um, and yeah, that's, 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 that's fun. So I'll be able to have a computer I can kind of do proof of concept stuff. Proof of concept stuff. Wow, I'll say that fast six times. Uh, before actually blowing away my current file server. And, uh... Let, having bad things happen. I mean, worst case scenario is I, I, I go back to the way that it was. Um, and I've, you know, just waste a weekend with... Uh, with effort of doing, um, you know, wasting time. I'm pretty hopeful, but we'll see. Hopefully by Sunday, uh, I will have everything, you know, hopefully by Sunday I'll have everything. Hopefully everything will work and I'll have a new, shiny, exciting 
uh, server that my Twitch bot will be running on. That's the hope. Again, I know you all care. I know this is, uh, I know you've all been an eagerly anticipating news of, uh, my OpenBSD experiments. Um, and you know, I appreciate your interest. I, I, uh, I'm glad that you all nerd out as much as I do. It's exciting stuff. I forgot to go, I was going to go to the Adventurer's Guild and sell all this extra rings and hammers and swords and things. Whoops. Okay, let's drop off some stew. <laughs> inventory is quite, I was like, hey, let me drop off a bunch of stuff. I literally took one thing out of my inventory. So, uh, let's do one more run. It's still, we still got some time and I still have some energy. Do one more, um, what should we call it? You know, mining thing. The thing where you go into the mine and you do stuff. What I know is going to be funny is if I ever end up developing, um, like dementia or Alzheimer's or something like that, um, no one will know because they'll think I'm just having one of my usual strokes. <laughs> like, honestly, like it. Like, my brain just quits working sometimes. I just, I don't know what's... <laughs> like, trying to, to talk in the, try, in the... Ah, crap. I left an Omni Geode behind. Oh, well. Um, like, trying to say something and then just completely forgetting how the English language works. It's, it's a bit of a thing. I don't know why I do that. I don't know what happens. Uh, did I pick up slime? Let me... You know what? This, um... That hardwood's worth worth it. <laughs> because I'm worth it. Okay. Alright, let's uh, do one last something. Um, let's just do this. There we go. And let's pop the coal in there. Anything else that needs to go in there? Put the hammer in there, that can get sold. I think we're good to head back to the farm. We'll sell some stuff. So basically, we need, we need to get ramped up for spring of year two here. Um, essentially, what needs to happen now is... Um, oh, I got a coffee bean. Uh, I need to sell some stuff. But I also need to... Sell the slime. Sell the bat wings. You can technically sell the crocus. I'm gonna sell the. I'm gonna start selling flowers now. I think because because Sandy, I'm pretty close to full hearts with Sandy. I think, and I have lots of flowers in the thing. I'll sell the snow yams. Uh, the rest of the stuff I think we're gonna kill. Sell the winter root. The rest of this stuff, I think we're gonna keep. I think, pretty sure. Yeah. So not that one. This one. Let's pop into here. Um, so geode, this is going to be one of those times where I'm running back and forth between chests. Uh, let's just add stuff into there. Great. So we're up to, I could make 36 sprinklers. That's actually good. That's actually good. That's going to be helpful. Um, we've got rubies. The rubies go over here for spicy eel. Aquamarine and the frozen tears go in there. And the topazes go in there, and the void egg goes in there, and the tree seeds can go in here, and the jades can go in there. What am I doing with that prismatic shard? I feel like I was going to forge my hammer or something with it. I should really do that, actually. I should write that down. Let me write that down. Uh, so this is, we're going into winter 28th. 28, that's, that's 29. 28. Um, plant 12 more coffee plants at some point as soon as I can. We're going to say um, forge forge hammer with Prizzy. Um, okay, so what do I do? In, in game tomorrow, basically, we're going to prep farm for us uh, for rhubarb. In case anyone's wondering, rhubarb is disgusting. Um, so basically, I'm going to basically try and make as many sprinklers as I can, 
We're going to get the farm filled up with sprinklers as much as we can. We want to get Ginger Island filled up with sprinklers as much as we can. So we just need a ton more sprinklers. Um, the priority is sprinklers, tappers, then kegs. That's, that's the priority. It's going to be a while before we can even think about doing kegs because um, most of our copper is going to be going towards sprinklers. Most of our iron is going to be going towards sprinklers in the short term. Um, at some point, I really need to get my house upgraded. <laughs> because if I have more space in the house, I can put more kegs in the house. Um, not We did this already. Cooking, crafting. Take care of the animals. It's going to be a new week tomorrow, so we could think about gifting. It's actually going to be a good idea to do gifting because it's the last day of winter. So, and then first thing in spring, I'm going to want to be, I don't want to hit the ground running. So gifting is actually not going to be a bad idea. Um, so yeah, gifting, prep the farm, uh, I'll take care of animals and stuff. Um, uh, get iron for everything. Um, and yeah, I think that's pretty much all we're doing, I think. Oh, I should also gather the oak resin as well. <gasps> ooh, uh, ooh, uh, mm, eh, ooh. These guys are done. Sweet. I'm gonna get these this stuff sold. Make a bit more money. Grab the jade as well. I really want to make more crystallariums, but I just I don't have uh, iridium. At some point, I'm gonna need to do that. All right. There's seven star fruit wine. That is gonna make a nice little difference. That's gonna be worth like. 20, 21 grand or something. Um, all right, let's throw the coffee bean in there. And I'm going to quickly refill these kegs. Because I think if I do it tonight, they will actually be done a little bit sooner. So I think there's a, th a new thing where they um passed out they've some of these things now finish first thing in the morning now i think i, I don't know i don't know if kegs count for that but whatever it's done there's twenty three thousand for that stuff there's twenty four thousand in total nice all right quick preview of the next day i think i'm gonna end a little bit early tonight um let's check the luck uh quick question about queen of sauce cranberry candy can I make a cranberry candy? And it's worse luck. Not a bad day to do gifting. Heading off into the rest of your game. Thanks very much, Blackbird Jam. Have a great night. Thanks for stopping in. Sugar. Crap, I need sugar. Okay, so we're going to buy sugar and make cranberry candy. I put Gansy for some reason. Uh, how many sugars do I need still? I need seven. So we're going to say buy seven sugar and make cranberry candy. I think I have more sugar on Ginger Island than I was using to make ginger ale. Um, have I made tropical curry? Make tropical curry. Um, and I think, does, uh, does, uh, does Leo like a tropical curry? I can't remember. Hey, Paul, guess what? My band is playing a show tonight in Zuzu City. Maybe at the bus stop around 4 this afternoon to leave for the show. You better be there. No promises, but it might be kind of fun. Okay. Gold bar from Clint. Nice. Thank you, Clint. Uh, oak. We want to harvest the oak resin as well. Did I write that down? I did not. Animals. Oak resin. Um... When I leave stuff to sync up, I'm only going to leave it for a day. Like, I don't want to wait around too much. Uh, let's just do a quick check of the fruit cave. Nothing. Quick check of the greenhouse. I think it says coffee beans, right? Yes, it is. Uh, animals. Oak resin. Greenhouse. Um... So animals, oak resin, greenhouse. Then we will prep uh, gifting. Then we will buy seven, go to town, we'll buy seven sugar, we'll come back, make the cranberry candy, make the tropical curry. Um, 
and then yeah we're off to the mine to get iron there we go so that's is the plan for next time we've got prep better prep for spring year two we are way more than halfway done we're, we're halfway done in game time but way more than halfway done in real time um so we're gonna prep this prep this prep the farm for spring um we'll do some other farm stuff um do some random stuff make some do some crap cooking and crafting stuff uh, and yeah, then we're just going to be on that iron grind, trying to get as much iron as we can to make even more sprinklers to make even more money because it's starting. Okay, thanks. Bye.